In this question, it is given that a die is tossed thrice, and we have to find the probability of getting an odd number at least once. Uh, when we have many events, when we have many trials going on, it rather than calculating all the possible cases of at least for getting at least once, it is easier to do it like probability of getting uh, at least. One odd number is equal to one minus of probability of getting all even numbers, right? If in every throw I get an even number, then that is the only case which we should not include in this uh, condition. In all other circumstances, this event is satisfied, right? So this is what I am going to do. Now to find the probability of getting even number in every throw, uh, I have to find out this value. So uh, it is given that a die is to thro tossed thrice. Uh, we know that uh, all the different throws are independent of each other. So this I can write as this is equal to one minus probability of even in first case, even in First throw into probability of even in second throw into probability of even in third throw, right? Because all the three throws are independent of each other. And what will be here? Nothing is mentioned about the die, so I am going to assume it as a fair die. So probability of getting an even number is what? Uh, there are three even numbers: two, four, and six. And total six possible outcomes. So probability of getting an even number will be three by six. This is the same in all three throws. So it is three by six into three by six into three by six. This is probability of getting even in all throws. Therefore, probability of getting at least one odd is one minus this, which is equal to one minus of three by six can be simplified as half half cube, which is one minus one by eight. Which is equal to seven by eight. This is our answer.